tank is 12 foot diameter, 22 foot tall. And the water comes in and it circulates around in here, gets clean. And then it discharges here over to the manhole over there and then out to the river. We're gonna put chambers underneath there and mm -hmm. this water will go into the chambers and never go to the river except when it exceedingly overflows the system. Not even at the river, back here, it'll go into the aquifer and recharge the aquifer. One we'll advantage of this too is a single point collection, right? You're picking up trash from a lot of areas and you got one point of maintenance. <laughs> Uh, one thing people often don't think about is that when they see dirty snow or, you know, gravel on the sidewalk or anything coming off a construction site, that it'll all get washed down and eventually end up at the river. And that sediment coats the bottom of the river and all the rocks where the fish's food would have grown gets covered up and it kind of kills the ecosystem. And so you have these big repercussions that we don't even really see on our level.